Hi there, my name is Justin Hutchings and I'm a Senior Program Manager on the Operating Systems Group. Today I'm here to talk to you about apps and devices that print in Windows 10 and Windows 10 Mobile. So this is an architecture slide that you may be familiar with if you followed along printing for the last few years. Um, the architecture is largely unchanged. A few things to point out. Um, we have a print manager and print dialog interaction um, on the left here. And that's used to set up the print job. That's how we get all the configuration data to your app. Um, and then we have a number of app rendering APIs available depending on what kind of content you use. So HTML5, XAML, those are both very easy. But if you have a more advanced app, you can certainly use Direct2D or um, the XPS Print Document Package Target API. Both of those are available. Now, new in Windows 10 is uh, a mobile support for printing on Windows 10 Mobile. That stack doesn't use any print drivers, so it's a bit different, and we'll talk about the details of that when we get into the IHV section. So comparing Windows 10 and Windows 10 Mobile, I mentioned that Windows 10 Mobile does not use print drivers, but there are a number of other um, differences that affect your customer's experience. First of all, on Windows 10, you're already familiar with the fact that that supports USB, network, shared, virtual printers. Whereas on mobile, we only support networked printers. On Windows 10, we install all printers ahead of time. Um, whereas on Windows 10 Mobile, they're all installed on demand. We discover them at runtime, and if they're compatible, we'll set them up automatically. Um, supported printers, we support any driver on Windows 10 that has a driver available, so practically any device that's been created. Um, whereas on Windows 10, we only support printers that support our new Windows Mobile stack. Um, that must support the WS Print protocol and one of our standard PDLs. And then finally on Windows 10, we support a lot of apps. Um, new Windows apps, older Windows 8 apps, and then Win32 apps and, and all the rest. Um, whereas on Windows 10 Mobile, only Windows apps are able to print. So if you have a Silverlight-based Windows Phone app, um, there's no change in the ability of that to support printing. So what printers do we actually support on Windows 10 Mobile? The answer is we've got over 1,900 printers supported right now. We're working closely with all the manufacturers to develop um, more printers that will be in the market this fall. Um, most popular brands are supported, and uh, we'll, we'll be able to release details on that closer to general availability of the product. Um, and as a bonus, we've actually added support for saving as a PDF, which is great if you don't happen to have a printer that's new enough to support Windows 10 Mobile, um, but you still want to get a receipt or something else saved to a, a fixed document. So with that, I think the most interesting thing to do is actually show you a demo of what printing from Windows 10 Mobile looks like. So I've got an app that I authored here um, using the new Windows Apps SDK that works for Windows 10 and Windows 10 Mobile. And so I've got a phone here. You can sort of see I've got a just a a simple document reader. This is using the Windows PDF API. And if I click the print button that I have, you'll notice that we go into a, a pretty familiar print dialog. And this printer that, that's sitting next to me here was automatically discovered. And I can set options on that if I want. I can change the copies or what have you. But I'm just going to actually show that it prints. Assuming I can find the button. There it goes. And it's preparing the document right now, rendering to this HP printer um, in a format we call PCLM. And so momentarily here, we'll have paper coming out. There it is. So you can see we have paper on the screen that um, matches what we had on the screen. All right. 